life can be so mind-boggling, mind-confused. Man, you can know, you can know God, you can, you can know His Word, you can know people of God, but you're gonna be alone and and and, 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 and feel alone, feel confused about a lot of things. About a lot of things. This is this is where dying and self plays an important role. I'm telling you, God knows I'm telling you the truth. This will die in itself because what's going to happen is you're going to start feeling empty and you're going to start feeling having remorse of yourself. You're going to start blaming yourself. And if self, just think about it. I want you to think about it. If, if, you, if, if self is dying, then you don't have to have remorse. You don't have to have sympathy uh, for yourself and feel fine. See, do you understand what I'm saying? I'm trying to show you that self, the flesh, comes in an evil way. God, God sees the flesh as evil. He would talk you out of good things. He would talk you out of good. He would talk you right into suicide. He would, take, he would talk you out into doing something wrong. That's why it's important to practice death to self. A lot of people don't understand or don't know how or what I mean by practice the death of self. And I really believe that those who God has called to follow, they are they are they are they are learning, they are doing, they are they are practicing because they have been listening at the spirit of God. See, see, we can't do nothing unless God lead us, guide us, teach us, open our eyes. And I'm conscious of all of that because death to self, that's what death to self is. It's the leading of God. It's being conscious of God. God making us conscious of him. Do you understand? God making us conscious of him. Do you understand? In the time where you feel, uh, you know, alone or if you, you know, and you start feeling those things. If you if you practice death to self and you start feeling those things, I'm telling you this here, you're gonna see that those things are not not you and not important because that's the flesh. You begin your your whole your whole conscious, your whole your whole your whole your whole center of your being will be about God. It will be about God. It'll be about his son, it'll be about the father, it'll be about, you know, um, um, Lord, what is, what is your, what is your next move, Lord, in my life, Lord, I know it's going to be spectacular, I know it's going to be powerful, you know why, you know why you're going to say that, you know why you're going to say, say those things, you know why you're going to feel them things, it's because the spirit is leading you to say those things, the spirit you 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 are in you are in uh, constant fellowship in your being. In your being, you're in constant fellowship. In your in, in, in your mind, and, 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 and revelations start coming in your mind that are uh, uh, still are things that don't even make any sense. Things that comes against you, those things right there will be. I'm telling you, they 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 will be like. You know, they'll be like water off a log. 